welcome to um, Seppi's vlog. I was actually going to say Persian Bunny. <laughs> Should I start again? No. Oh. <laughs> Rewind. <laughs> hey guys, you're welcome just recording to... your forehead. Oh shit, my man. I mean, excuse me, boop. <laughs> up hey vlog you probably couldn't see me before and we were trying to book our plane tickets in the car I don't really know who else's family is backwards like ours in that we're doing our sh clothes shopping for the holiday before we have our tickets I can probably say in this vlog where we're going we're going to Tehran super exciting Bedas, bedas, bedas. Get oh yeah oh yeah oh yeah <laughs> Sol's not on it today. I usually make Sol dance in all our vlogs. Go on, Sol. Come on, take one for the team. Stop it. Stop saying Persian that. money. Stop <laughs> saying that. Take one for the team and then call me Persian money. <laughs> Bentley tints. Okay, I hate this sunlight view thing on the camera, so I will check back in in Selfridges where I'll show you guys what we like to shop for our holidays. Stop focusing on you, I'm just trying to zoom oh, in on Seppi being a little diva. How's it going, sir? Just stopping for a quick snack at the Yo Sushi here in Selfridges. We love salmon avocado hand rolls. Also, I don't know why I haven't taken my salmon. Also, I don't know why I just keep going to get myself. The guy who works here is Bear Grumpy. Tell the vlog what we're showing. So basically, I bought this cake. So. Not just randomly. It's like graduation. No, she's just got. We've got some friends coming over for a barbecue. Yeah, it's not randomly. We have basically we're doing like this. She's coming. I don't want to see the cake. How pretty is this? So Sol graduated from dentistry. So she's left me now. She's come to London. So. It is the next day, it's Saturday, and honestly, you guys, I'm being so lazy. Let me catch you up. One, I'm not even wearing pants right now. Like, I CBA, I'm just in a giant t-shirt, no makeup, chilling, trying to do a project, and literally procrastinated for four hours. I've been on YouTube, I've been on... Instagram, I've been texting friends, making plans for like later with like eight different people at like five different places. Um, I'm basically just hoping they're all gonna come to where I am. But um, yeah, so I've just been so lazy. Um, and two, my room is an absolute mess. I bought some stuff from Zara that I'm gonna show you guys now. But um, I couldn't show you my room because my suitcase is still on the floor from Can. And I would pack it back up, but considering I'm going back to, back on holiday, I'm going to Tehran, and then from Tehran we're going to a couple of places, so I don't see the point because I'm leaving in three days. Three days? Um, 
and I have this project due and I'm just being lazy and I'm going out to see April after. So I just thought bring you up to speed because I'm making myself food I haven't eaten yet and it's like four in the afternoon because I've just been lazy. Like I was meant to make myself something or at least go out and get food but I've been so bad. So yeah, I went to Zara. I got a few things. Some of them were on sale, some of them weren't. So I just thought I'd quickly show you. First thing I got were these plain denim shorts. I think they are so cute. Um, they are like just your standard denim shorts. They were $17.99 and I think they will be good with like crop tops and like wedges or something. Um, so next I got a pair of black jeans, black high-waisted skinny jeans again from Zara. They, they were on sale down to $12.99 and they are just literally your black plain high-waisted skinny jeans. I love Zara jeans. I get mine in a size 6 just because I like them to be tight and I always lose weight in summer because it's really hot usually where I go and I can't force myself to eat um, in the daytime even though when I'm in London I don't feel like that because I'm, in, I'm at home my house is cooler like literally yesterday I ate so much that like my friends were laughing at me and like how where do you put all this but when I'm away on holiday I can't eat a lot so I always lose weight in summer um, so I get them to be snug in a size 6 I got this cap from the men's section of Zara. It just says trust yourself and I feel like I'm gonna wear this in like an airport when I can't bother to like have my hair down or whatever. Um, just like this and like a backpack for casual vibes. This was on sale um, down to 6 99 from 13 pounds. I got this pair of boyfriend jeans. They were 12 99 as well on the sale. And I feel like they'll look super cute. I have similar ones from H&M. But my H&M ones don't fit nicely around my waist. I might just give it away to like charity or something when I'm in Iran. Um, but yeah, I thought it was such a good bargain as well. These are also, these are in a size 8. So um, it's a mum fit as well. I really hope it's not the same issue as with the H&M ones. But hopefully not because these are like a baggier fit hopefully it'll be completely fine also i cannot believe i'm literally on camera looking like my out of rolled out of bed and revision mode this is what i look like when i study for exams guys not pretty all right the last thing i got was such a bargain from the sale like i was just shocked when i saw it and it was this like um really formal oh it's got fluff on it and obviously i wasn't really shopping for winter stuff but when i saw this I was like, this is so nice and just, in my opinion, this is perfect for placement. It's really chic. Um, and in winter, I always want like a nice chic coat when I'm on placement. And I always end up wearing Montclair's, which looks stupid. And this was, look at that bargain, $95.99 down to $29.99. So I was like, I have to get this. The last item I got was from $12.99 and it's literally just a plain white tee with little sequins on it that was a mini haul for you guys right <laughs> little secret for me when i'm really lazy with cooking there is two things that i always run to because it's super fast to make the first thing i always make myself super lazy when i i want something in like five ten minutes is this it's the pasta and sauce mac and cheese i like the cheese and broccoli one too and i'll literally just add tuna to it and I'll have like a salad with it and for me that's like a student life meal even though I live at home <laughs> um, but yeah I discovered this when I was living in halls so I love this another lazy thing that I love to make um, if I really can't be bothered to cook or go out to eat or anything and I want something fast is this ramen so I'll either have it as a ramen add hot, hot water and I'll add like chicken or tuna and an egg and some cheese or something like that or I will boil the the ramen noodles with hot water and the sauce and then I'll drain the water and I'll add one spoon tablespoon of Philadelphia cream cheese and tuna and oh that tastes so divine to me it tastes so good I don't I've run out of tuna right now so I'm not gonna have that because I don't want to have that much noodle um without any like substance to it like tuna but this is just mac and cheese so I think I can get away with it without any tuna um so I'm just gonna have this now don't judge guys, I know it's super lazy and unhealthy, but yeah.
I guess I want my vlogs to be the real me, not just what people think like, oh, she must eat out all the time or she must eat healthy all the time. Like, yeah, I do workouts, I go gym, I, I, but I'm also human and I like stuff like this too. <laughs> Let me know in the comments if you guys have ever had this or the cheese and broccoli one. The cheese and broccoli one is my fave and I always make these for like my closest friends. I just thought I'd show you guys that finished product. Whilst I was cooking this, I was just thinking that I'm going to insert a picture of what I looked like literally four days ago on the beach in Cannes. And the reason why I'm going to do that is because I know that there's so much, like on social media, so much stuff out there that makes you think, oh, like this person's body's like this, they probably don't eat anything or they don't look like this all the time and all that's not like it might be true for some people but it sure as hell is not true for me i have to have a balanced lifestyle i have to eat the things i want when i want them and i keep clean like 80 percent of the time 75 percent of the time the other 25 percent of the time i eat what i want because you only live once and i will be confident in whatever body i have because i know i've worked out for it i take care of it and you know at the end of the day everything that matters is your health and you being confident in yourself so just wanted you guys to know eating a pasta eating whatever that you fancy i had like so much cake last night because we had a little cake for my sister in the shape of a tooth um like eating anything you want obviously in moderation is completely fine don't ever feel like it's not gonna stop you from reaching your goals or don't ever feel like people who look like that don't you know eat anything because it's it's not true and that's just something small I want to so I've come to meet these two we're at Mia it's the same vlog you don't need to say hi again <laughs> also me and Sina are kind of matching I love her dress really pretty I have <laughs> I tell them what happened when you were at dinner so basically we went for dinner and then there was this table next to us and they were like these Iranian guys and they didn't know we were Iranian and they were saying these like vulgar things not about us but just in general about their life experiences I have never ever ever experienced oh my god like, it made mummy blush. <laughs> I wasn't that. I have never ever like. I literally, I couldn't eat. I had to like. I was eating, right? What's <laughs> Talk to the vlog. Talk to the vlog. Introduce yourself. What's happening? What's that? That's a thousand views right there. A thousand views is promised. Let's see. <laughs> So as you can see, I'm just starting to pack up, but this is basically my suitcase from the holiday I came back from last week and I kind of, everything that's been washed um, is like on the side to go back in and my suitcase is going to be split down the half, half for um, Iran and like Islamic Republic and half like swimsuits and stuff like that for for where we go Uh Afterwards, I did a bit of shopping from net a -Porter. I thought I'd show you guys so we end this vlog on just this little tiny Not haul because there's only two items in here, but I thought I'd show you guys. I'm literally sitting on the stairs in my house, so I basically need to try on one of the items because they if they don't fit, I only have like tomorrow in the daytime to send it back. But Nessa Porte had a sale on this, so it was a pair of night trainers um, that I've really wanted for ages. And I need like black trainers for the gym. And every time I'm with my trainer, I always say to him, like, he's always like, your outfit looks cool. And I'm like, yeah, but I need black trainers to go with it. I don't have any um, gym black trainers. I have like designer black trainers that I've never wear to the gym. So these are just some good workout trainers and they are the nike they're called the fly knits um nike so i buy the nike size 7 which is a uk size 4 so i'm going to try them on now just to make sure that they fit but this is what they look like and they're just super simple gym trainers i'm really happy with them they were like 120 pounds down to 60 um and they're like classic nike gym trainers so when i saw that they were on sale i was like have to grab these 
to the gym. I can take them away with me if I want, but I don't think I'll need to. I know it's not winter, but I was just like, oh my god, this looks so perfect in winter. So, I'm going to show you guys. So, it is this scarf from Off-White. Oh wow, it's actually much thicker and nicer than I thought it would be. So, it's got like the Off-White logo on this way and then what does it say on this side on this side it says fire fire line do not cross so yeah this way around and this way around it says this and i just feel like this is such a cool scarf for winter i have designer scarves that aren't really statements they're just wintery plain but i feel like this over a bomber jacket or just you know when you want to do a casual is super cool it's got like the off-white logo and it's like a classic kind of monogram off-white and I don't have anything off-white it's my first item from them but it looks really cool for winter so I'm gonna continue packing um, if you watch my makeup my beauty video then my summer look then you would know that I'm actually off to Istanbul tomorrow and then from Istanbul we're going straight to Tehran and we are hopefully going on a couple of the trips from Tehran before I come back to start uni on the 30th of July. Summer is literally flashing before my eyes. I can't get over how fast it's going, but I'm loving it. I can't lie, this has probably been one of the best, or if not the best, summer of my life. And you guys have been able to follow through my vlogs, which I'm really happy about. I've managed to keep vlogging like I wanted. Um, if you guys like my vlogs, then please give it a thumbs up and let me know in the comments. I love reading the comments. I usually reply to all the comments. Um, and make sure to follow my socials. My Instagram is Persian Bunny. My Twitter is The Persian Bunny. And my Snap is Sepi Samai. And I shall be seeing you guys in Istanbul, Tehran. Love you guys so much and I'll see you next time. Bye.